investigating. A 90-year-old man was convicted of murder this afternoon and shortly after that was taken away to jail in his wheelchair. A judge, not a jury, reached that verdict, all stemming from a shooting involving two former friends. Harold Hayes has the latest. 90-year-old William Welsh entered the Allegheny County Courthouse all week pushed in a wheelchair by his family, but late today after his bond was revoked, he left the courtroom in a wheelchair guided by sheriff's deputies. Judge Tom Flaherty ruled that the shooting death of William Many at a homestead construction site next to Welsh's funeral home last year was the result of third-degree murder. He found malice and no self-defense justification. Many and Welsh had an intense feud that boiled over when Welsh fired two shots into Many's neck. Welsh's family, though, argued they were afraid of Many, who they say constantly threatened them. But at the time of his arrest, Welsh was not apologetic. During the trial, Welsh required headphones and a transcript so he could follow along. I went to the door to his funeral home, and it's a three-story home. I went to the door. I can hear the TV outside. And just in that past week, it, his hearing had just declined. So I asked what happened, and he's looking at the TV. The TV's at 95, when ordinarily it's like 20, 21 is pretty loud. It's at 95, and it's, that's, that was okay for him. Hearing problems and other ailments will be at issue when it's determined where Welsh will serve his time. He faces five to 40 years. He understood the judge's decision. He didn't agree with it. He didn't obviously agree with it, but he understands there's consequences. Welch will be sentenced in June, but any sentence for a man 90 years old is potentially a life sentence. From downtown Harold Hayes, KDKA TV News. A man from Marshall Shadeland will stand trial accused of...